It's nice all week, and then Saturday comes around. Do you get those, those, oh. those head jerks. She used to be deadly with those. Just when you thought today was going to be a write-off. Oh, we're at the flea market. Clark's hitting the gritty. And uh, we got a wild pap spotting here. We're going to go try to find some cool stuff. I'm looking for any kind of uh, 90s toys, action figures, video games, memorabilia. Your stick, sir. Thank you. Oh, oh, look at you guys. Oh, my goodness. You are just, like, the best thing ever. Oh, my god. He's like, hi, Clark, man. He's so fluffy. Oh, how much? How much? I'll take you. I'll take the both. I'll take the two. Buy one, get one free, maybe? I think they're just hanging out here, actually. All right, my day's complete. Let's go home. I'm good. I, I pet a dog. Okay, bye. Might be some Pokemon over here. And there might also be some, like, some Pokemon. I see him. Look at Dragonite. Look at this opera. Pikachu, This is like Clark's dream come true. Oh, I don't know if that's Mario. <laughs> I don't know if this is. Us. That's a uh, Snario. <laughs> but look at all this. Oh my god! These are like uh, like just figures. And stuff. Fifteen dollars. Articulation. Oh, they got Ash in here too. He fell yeah. off of his spot. These are those gold cards that are they're fakes. Oh, how much are the awesome for those? Uh, Three dollars each. Yes, yeah, so I got those. I'm sure they're not real, dude. Spotted something. Got the red arm. Thirty bucks though. Like what? Been a little spoiled with yard sale prices, so it's a little painful being at a flea market. But yeah, they got to make money and stuff. So that's. I know. I always collect these kind of things. Save. 10 bucks, that'd be like 50 cents at the yard sale. Yeah, I love that. See, there's heat, there's heat man the in there. Shell trailer, that's cool. Look at the shell and stuff, man. Mm -hmm. I thought I saw Gambit in here, but it was this guy. I don't know who that is, even. What do we got over here? I see some action figures. Sir, just out of curiosity, and I love it. Hey, yo! Ten dollars each, though. For sealed action figures. Yeah, there's a Atari and games in here for 40 bucks. Got any good games? Oh, they got an ET classic. Got my first acquisition, a little bit of a gamble. Got the Atari 2600 with six games, two controllers and two paddle controllers, 30 bucks. I feel like that's honestly not very bad. If you're curious about the games, uh, there they are there. We got a Pac-Man. We got Circus Atari, Barnstormer, Combat, E.T. Quite possibly the worst game ever made. I'm gonna run this out to the car and then come back down because this is, uh, it's bigger than my backpack. I was just admiring this as I was walking and I noticed the manual's in here too. Right here. Okay, I'm looking at this sign here. Pretzel braid. Are you hungry at all? Yeah, I'm hungry. Let's see what these looks like. So they're a little sweeter and a little softer than regular pretzels. I'll trade you that <laughs> for that. <laughs> This will give Clark Man the power to do the flea market. He's giving it a not bad, a not bad rating. Oh, got a transformer. Dude, a Megatron. Forty bucks. Oh, some old school wrestling action figures. The pretzel braid, a little drier than when I typically like my pretzels, but. Not bad. I still worth it. Yeah. Dude back there had a Nintendo for a hundred dollars with three basic games with it. My Atari was a at first, steal. At first I didn't like this, but now I like it even more. Oh, you're coming around. What's Pap doing over there? Pap's having a little campfire. <laughs> this is a Bud Man set up here. Yeah, look at this. He already bought them all. That's gonna be us here in a second. Hot fries coming out. I gave you your change, right? Yeah, you did. Yep. No, you didn't. I'm just kidding. Thank you so much. We've got French fry happening and uh, whoopie pies. Whoopie pie life. That's peanut butter, I believe. Oh yeah. And that's pumpkin. That's better than OG. Got the Halo Four and Call of Duty, eight dollars each. There's probably some stuff here that's worth incredible amounts. I would imagine. I just don't know enough about it. Because you don't have plastic that will never break. 
This is crazy. They said, do you want to bring some cars? They said, yes. What we saw on the way here. Mm -hmm. That's a lot. Half the battle of being at the flea market is figuring out where the heck Pap made his way to. There he is. I see him walking down here. Look at that. That might be the coolest thing of the day. I keep seeing all these things and thinking they're video games. Dinosaur. Robot. Xbox games. Hey. Hot Shots Golf Out of Bounds for PlayStation 3. It's like a $10 to $15 game. Yeah, well, all these PS3 games that you yeah. can play. Most of them are sports and yeah, Call like, of Duty um, and stuff. I don't need them that bad. Wait, Xbox 360? Why is it blue? Because it's sun faded, probably. That looks, but, that looks that cool, though. Stuff. That looks cool, though, the blue. It kind of does. I go to buy this, and it's just a bunch of people sitting in a circle just staring at me. I'm like, anybody, anybody want three bucks? They took it. Good acquisition, though. I love the Hot Shots Golf games. Didn't have this one. Definitely got to do some cleanup on this container it's in, though. It's looking pretty, pretty rough. But the disc is immaculate, and it's complete. Uh-oh. This is insane. For man. 10 bucks. This is like a Pokemon... It's articulate too. Toxtricity? Oh. Wow. This is actually not bad. That's pretty neat. Look at that. It's got knees and arms. I think it's one of these Pokemon Select figures. Yeah, it's Pokemon Select. I think that price wow. is good too. Wow. Okay. Parkman's first score of the day. Toxtricity. For 10 bucks. My, I gotta do an unboxing on this when I get home. I was thinking we could uh, unbox it here, get rid of the box and put it in my backpack, but... Oh yeah, maybe you could film in the car for me. To, yeah, I can do that. You want to put that in my backpack? I can fit that in there. I enjoy carrying it. Okay, it if you happy. get tired of carrying it, I gotta... You make me feel happy in front of myself. Okay. <laughs> I'm glad you found something, bud. I had no idea I'd actually find anything. That's the beauty of the flea market. You never know. There could be stuff like this, or there could be Pokemon in the I next corner. That, I, today, I doubted they'd have anything like this. They're Pokemon Flex figure. I'm crossing. I feel like I expect that at a flea market. Show Pap what you got. I got a Pokemon Flex Tristan. That's a good thing. That's awesome. It's a nice little setup here. Wow. Yeah. We don't have benches like this. That's beautiful. Yeah. That guy is looking... So crispy. Look at how good that gets. Look at that evil look on his face. Mm -hmm. Just the, wanting to be. He's even got neck articulation too. Uh huh. That moves wow. up and down. That's cool, man. Yeah. Look, you also got yeah. waist too. Look at that. You got waist too. Look Very cool. Fifty bucks. That's a, that's insane. Good lord. Fifteen for a crunched up ten dollars. <laughs> Welcome to the flea market, boys. Yeah, you thought you could hide. <laughs> Oh, six. Wow. A little bit cheaper than in the store. Yeah, it's cheaper than eight bucks. We got some Star Wars stuff in here. Nothing. Oh, I can't even give these away on eBay. I'm trying to sell them. Yeah, they got Masters Universe stuff up here. House trucks. Wow. This is really cool. I love places like this, man. Find a little stockpile of Lego in here. These are two for five for minifigs. Some of them are uh, kind of vintage, but most of them are pretty filthy and dirty. There's a big bird. He was not in the skies enough. You have the turtle in there. Oh, did you see the venom that's under there? He is not posable. Got Xbox 360, PS3, and Wii. It seems to be the the norms out here. These ones have been out for a while. They're all faded and stuff, like you were talking about, buddy. See all the the blues? They've been out here. We got like two more rows left, so we're running out of spots. What do we got here? I see games. Oh, they. Oh, wow. Okay. We might have found the honey hole. Anything that I need in my life. I'm playing that right now, actually. $10 each. Woo! Salty. Yeah, bud. 
upper seven. Oh, man. Oh, upper seven. Stuff. They got Mikey. You have that one. Yeah, yeah, Mikey, they got Raph. Raph. They're cool. That's a that's a not a bad price for seven. Yeah. That's a that's not a bad this price for seven. Yeah. Not bad. Prices are very fair. Very fair. Just gonna have to take a gander. Oh, okay. Okay. I see what I might be interested in. The old bags. Four dollars each, Clark. Wow, that's actually like a really good price on bulk. I have so much though. I really do, but that is that is very fair. Very fair. No mini figs or anything. Just, well, maybe a little bit in there. But that's fair. Can you see what they are in there? No, I can't see. Mystery packs, huh? Oh, they don't want you to see it. It's a secret. Secrets. One dollar per pack. You, you can take a gamble if you want. I'll take a gamble. We should know that they're most likely real, right? Yeah. Okay. Do a gamble on it. Clark will do a haul video where you can see what's inside that mystery pack. And maybe this too. Maybe I'll do... A two for get, one. Maybe I'll do this when I get home. I do like a haul video. Okay. Oh, this is neat. Wow. I don't even know where to start there. This looks like something down here. Yeah, I got you, buddy. Usually you're like Pokemon senses are tingling, huh? You're like, I smell Pokemon. From a mile away. I smell Pokemon right there. Yeah, they got a couple, whole bunch of figures here. Got some Thomas stuff down here, buddy. Right here. Has the Spencer's. Stepney. These are. These feel very old, eh? No prices. These were ten dollars for all four of these guys. I don't know what their value is, but I thought that was pretty darn fair. They got Xbox games here, and they're a uh, dollar. I might be buying a bunch of stuff here, actually. I just got 10 Xbox games for $10. That's yard sale prices, baby. I'll show these to you later, because uh, we're kind of in the mix here. Just literally filled our entire backpack today. <laughs> that's, that's a good day at the flea market. The only thing left to do is to get some grub, and this is all food stuff all throughout here. The chicken on the stick looking miraculous with the bun on top. <laughs> well, Clark Man's destroying chicken. Paps over here at the hot sausage stand. That's what we had for dinner last night. And breakfast. And breakfast. I got two slices just in case we get extra hungry. What an awesome day though. We got chicken on a stick, we got pizza, we got lots of scores. Just winning at life at the flea market. That's how you do it right there. Paps meal, my meal. <laughs> That's a wrap. Unless we find something on the way out. Inventive. I'd say we dominated this place. We went down through every line, got everything. Bonus cider. <laughs> we should get one of those. Yeah, you just drive your truck around. You could look out the little window in the front there. <laughs> As promised, here are all the Xbox games that I got. Ten for ten dollars. We got Jade Empire, Sega GT 2002, MLB 2K5, Turok Evolution, Quantum Redshift. We got Forza Motorsport, a game I already have. Mech Assault, Rally Sport Challenge. We got Lord of the Rings, Return of the King, and Blood Wake. I didn't look at prices of any of these up, but for a dollar each, I snagged. And then here's a better look at the Thomas trains that I got. We got Stepney, we got Duke, we got Scar Louie, and this is Victor. All for $10 for those, $10 for these, $3 for this, and $30 for all the Atari stuff. Pretty solid day out there, I'd say. And some whoopie pies, too. <laughs>